sculpture is already complete within the marble block before I start my work. It is already there. I just have to chisel away the superficial material, say Michelangelo, great Italian sculpture. Hello fellow Toastmasters and viewers. When I hear this above quote, people who come to my mind are my teachers and my mentors. As everyone's primary learning starts with English alphabets A, B and C. Same for me, my journey of public speaking and envision towards Toastmasters mentoring starts with these three alphabets A, B and C. Are you all ready to know what that A, B and C means? In my early days of Toastmasters journey, after doing many roles in my club, I used to tell to my mentor, Aka, I didn't want best speaker, best evaluator, best tag role player, best TT speaker awards. At that time, she used to tell me, Naveen, listen carefully. Not only in your club, in your life, when you do anything, your mind should tell only one thing. That is, winning is more important than participation. Winning is more important than participation. And the next second when you finished it, your mind should tell only one thing. That is, participation is more important than winning. Participation is more important than winning. No matter you win or lose, the important thing is what you learned, what experience you gained from that. Like this, many positive quality was put forth by my teachers and my mentors in my life. Not only they told me, they helped me to apply this in my life. That made me to stand in front of you all today. So fellow Toastmasters and viewers, I hope you all guessed what the letter A stands for. The letter A means Amplify. A for Amplify. Have you ever heard how the mother eagle teaches her baby eaglets to fly? The mother eagle grabs one of her eaglets with her claws and takes it high up in the air. The baby eaglet loves to see all the beautiful sights soaring in the air. But right at that time, the mother eagle opens her claws. The baby eaglet started heading towards the ground 90 miles per hour. Fellow Toastmasters, I am sure the baby eaglet thinks, Are you mad? Mom, are you trying to kill me? But before the eaglet hits the ground, the mother eagle swaps down and grabs with her claws. At that time, the baby eaglet says, Thank you so much, Mom. I can't be able to face all these challenges. Please, Take me back to the home. But the mother eagle again takes it up high in the air and drops it again and again and again until the baby eaglet starts flying. When it starts flying, the baby eaglets flattering his wings, soaring all through the air, saying himself, this is what I was created to be. The same story applies for me. My mentor left me alone when I was to face challenges in my leadership and communication. At that time, I thought, why Akka is leaving me alone? But today, I got the answer for it. And I too, as that baby eaglet, soaring all through the Toastmasters and saying to myself, this is what you was created to be. Flapping my two exuberant wings 
one my communication another my leadership fellow toastmasters and viewers i hope from this story you can get what the letter b means the letter b stands for being mother eagle being mother eagle most of my friends and my club members say i am too courage bold and confident in my toastmasters journey but i wasn't be like this a year back my eye contact was poor i used to give my speech looking at my script too bad at improv speaking no knowledge on district division area joined me division council area council nothing but I had been new from before today you all may say this all are because of your confidence courage and boldness but fellow toastmasters and viewers courage lies in preparedness preparedness lies in knowledge knowledge lies in thirst to acquire it the thirst to acquire it which was taught by my teachers mentors and the envision towards toastmasters mentoring such that i can conclude the letter c stands for confidence in turn the confidence lies the thirst to acquire it hope the alphabets a b and c will teach me the meaning of other alphabets of public speaking and envision towards those masters mentoring as the quote mentioned first navin is the complete marble block with full of talents the sculptures are my mentors and teachers chisel is the alphabets a b and c the superfluous materials are my fear lack of confidence last finally the most important complete sculpture is toastmaster navin the complete sculpture is toastmaster navin last fellow toastmasters and viewers we can't give back anything to our sculptures such that our teachers and mentors we can't replace anything to their wisdom except one thing which is being grateful to them be thankful to them say thank you always to them thank you thank you